Stress in the workplace and really in life in general, it's just inevitable. Today I wanted to talk about what your relationship and your reaction to stress in the workplace looks like. People tend to have one of three different reactions when they're under very stress, when they're in very stressful situations. The first reaction that some people tend to have is to avoid the situation. So if you fall in this category, you might find yourself avoiding getting something done altogether because you just feel like you're under too much stress. You tend to shut down. You might find yourself procrastinating before getting going on this stressful task. The second reaction is to want to plow through the task at lightning speed or to use that stress to fuel your productivity. The thing is though, that both of those reactions are just different sides of the same coin. They're both fueled by our reptilian brain or our primitive brain. And really we're working in an unconscious state when we're in these two states. If those, if one or the other of those um, reactions that I just described, you recognize yourself in that, know that it's not a conscious reaction. The third way that people tend to react to stress is to be present with it, to feel that stress, and to not let it either have them shut down or to fuel them to the extent that ultimately if we're plowing through things at lightning speed, we're going to end up in a burnout. So this third choice is a more conscious, mindful state where we're aware of the stress and we can sit with that uncomfortable feeling of having too much on our plate or not knowing what to do next and not have it drive our actions in a way that doesn't work for us. If you're interested in learning more about this, you can check out my blog on my website, lindsaylapaquette.com. There's a whole section on mindfulness that goes through all sorts of tips to help you get into that third state of being able to be present with your stress at work. Thank you for watching, guys.